Ladies, gentlemen, this is how you make your very own personalized license plates in GTA Online. First and foremost, you want to go to the website on screen, which you can also find in the link in the description down below. When you're on the website, you want to click on the new order button. On the next screen, you'll be able to select what the background is of the license plate, as well as the text that you want to have, which you can fill in on the text box right here. Spoiler alert, by the way, we can finally now have a space in between words. So if you want to, for example, have I speed as a license plate like I'm doing here, you can put a space in between the I and the word speed, which is absolutely fantastic because previously we never really be able to do that outside from some uh, funky glitches and things that we probably shouldn't have been doing anyways. Also, a nice little addition to the website too, while rather slow and glitchy at the time of recording, you are also able to see how it will look on your car, or at least the Banshee in the example here. Once you're happy with how your license plate works, you can go to the next page. In the next page, you can find a drop down screen with the last personal vehicles that you drove. In my case, I went for the Santorno. Now there's two things that are very important. You need to be in a GTA Online session before you place the order. Order. So, it can be in an invite only session, no problem. You have to also make sure that the vehicle that you select for the license plate custom order, that you drive that particular vehicle to a Los Santos custom. If you don't do so, you will not be able to apply the new license plate and it will not be able to be selected for other vehicles. Once you have placed the order, simply wait a few seconds and you should receive a text message in game with the confirmation that the license plate can now be picked up. Again, make sure that you drive the vehicle that you selected on the website to the Los Santos Customs in order to complete the order. Once you drive into Los Santos Customs, you'll be prompted with a screen asking you to pick up the order. Obviously, you want to do that. And from there, you now have this custom license plate within the game. There's probably a few things that you are wondering. Yes, you are able to apply this particular license plate to any other vehicle that you own. So for example, I applied the custom license plate that I made onto my Hakuchi here. I'm also able to change the color of the license plate background if I wish to do so, while the text doesn't change. I can also switch to any of my other custom license plates if I wish to do so, without having to worry about losing my other license plate. Basically, the TLDR is that once you have ordered the license plate, it will stay within your game and you don't have to worry about it any further. Now, of course, there's only 30 slots available for your license plate. So if you want to delete one of them, all you have to do is go back to the website and then click on the license plate that you want to delete. At the bottom left, you can see this nice shiny red button. Just click on that and then you can delete the license plate. It will then no longer be available within game. And obviously, if you change your mind, you can just simply make a new one. If if you happen to place the order and you make a bit of an error with spelling and you realize that speed uh, with uh, two threes looks a bit ridiculous, you can obviously then go back to the page again and just edit the license plate and then go back to Los Santos Customs again to pick it up and get the correct spelling without looking like a cringe lord. Wait a minute. Other than that, that's all there is to it. If you found it useful or enjoyed it, make sure to leave it a like, subscribe for more, and if you like what you see on the channel, become a member like Chloe and GTA+. Plus. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all later.